Hey, this is Van Lake Productions here, and I, today I am doing the four mocks on one base plate challenge. I saw a thing, and uh, I saw this from David Productions, and special thanks to him. He said I could do it, and he originally got it from I think it was Rocket Launcher Studios. Yeah, so special thanks to him too for letting me do this, and. Yeah, this is actually kind of hard, because you have to find the exact amount, and, like how to split it up and everything. So yeah, so I'll show you the first one right now. So this one, these are all uh, pretty much Civ uh, Galactic Civil War, Imperial vs. Rebel times. But we do have one Clone Wars one there. Alright, so I'll start with this one. This is, I named it the Ambush in the Forest event. This is on Endor. And there's, you can see there's just a few trees, two of them. Scout Trooper on a speeder bike. A rebel hiding right there. This tree is from some Lego City set, that one. And, uh, that one I... Made myself back there. Yep, there's just a little bit of detail, and there's a little river there with this blue stud stacked. I know you can see the sand a little bit. That's the color of the space plate, it's the sand one. But yeah, it's pretty good. And then there's just like a bush there. It's a pretty good design. Just have them all going down one by one so they look like they form a bush. There's more just leaves there. And their speeder bike is just held up by a clear stand and a few studs on the bottom. And next one we have the Dewback Patrol on Tatooine. It just has, this isn't really a battle, this is just... Yeah, basically just like the Dewback Patrol. This is probably when they were looking for the droids after they got out on the escape pod. C-3PO and R2-D2. Yeah, that's just the one from the Cantina set. The newer one, and it uh, just has the Sand Trooper on there. Some detailing of the sand. Yep, not much to see on this one, but it's cool because... I just wanted to show my do back in my sand trooper. And then this one right here is based off of Star Wars Battlefront, the newer one. As you can see, I got those three stormtroopers from the battle pack. One dead, and then the shock trooper. He has his backpack I made for him and a custom gun that I made too. And uh, there's just a normal one. They don't have the jump packs on. And then there's that old uh, Shadow Trooper from 2008, so that's pretty cool. I just picked that one up. I don't have the actual set that he came in, just the minifig. Then there's the Rebel Trooper with a custom gun, too. You saw this guy in my haul. He's relatively new. And yeah, he's from 2008, too. Only in two sets. He's only in two sets, too, I think. But Yeah, he's pretty cool minifig. And of course, I just have the set. Or I don't have the set, I just have the minifig. And then there's just Han Solo running. And this is supposed to be on Solist. I think that's how you pronounce it. Yeah, that was the one battle on. Yeah, just the normal battle. Conflict on Solist, I think you call it when you play it. Yeah, just versus. And then finally, this the one Clone Wars one. Right back there. Yep, I, as you can see, I don't have the Phase 2 Captain Rex. I only have Phase 1, which is, they are both pretty rare, though. Then I have Anakin Skywalker just right there. And a 501st Trooper. I know I know uh, there were not really any battle droids in the Darkness on Umbara episodes in the Clone Wars, but... I just uh, didn't have any Ambarans, so I just used Commander Droids. And then as you can see, these are pretty cool here, like the little 
plant things that were just growing there. And soul just like black terrain. Yeah, that one's just facing down. I have one there, and then I have like half of one right there. It's cut off, kind of. Yeah, like the river's cut off there on the Endor Mock, too. Yep. And there's another one. Those two are constructed similarly, but not exactly the same. So you can see, then this one I think is the best. This is just that long pole that goes up. And just tips over to the side. And yeah, that's pretty much it. I just built this today, actually. As soon as I finished it, I did the video. And thank you for, again to uh, David Productions for letting me make this. And thank you to Rocket Launcher Studios for coming up with the idea. Because this is pretty cool. And okay, that's it.